what we're looking at. This is the video that I actually recorded maybe two weeks ago, but I completely lost my sh because this is meant to be a tomato. Turns out this is a red pepper. Right, we're talking about the Pomodoro technique. This is a study technique where you are giving yourself set little breaks at regular intervals. And the purpose of that is to kind of let yourself chill out a little bit and be like in the frame of mind of don't get distracted, you're gonna get a break in 25 minutes. But I first wanna talk about um why is it called Pomodoro? So the name Pomodoro comes from an Italian word meaning tomato, tomato, and it's based upon these little tomato timers, this is meant to be a tomato, which are used in Italian cooking, you just set it to your timer and bish bash bosh, off you go. That's where the name comes from, that is literally it. Now. The Pomodoro Technique is just this method of taking regular timed breaks. What is most common is this one. 25 minutes off, no, 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 that's wrong. 25 minutes on, and then five minutes off, and then repeat. So you have regular breaks. This is amazing for anyone like me who struggles to concentrate and to not let yourself get distracted because you're gonna have that five minute off. So it's really easy to stay focused for 25 minutes. What you're meant to do though is after four repeats of that, you then take a longer, like a 15 minute break or whatever. In that break, you can do whatever you want. You can just sit, you can pick up a book, you can go pee pee, whatever you want. What I like to do though is as soon as that alarm goes off, I get up and I'm gone. Now, I'm not saying everyone buy these timers because they're actually really cumbersome and pretty put. I thought I was buying a tomato, I specifically ordered it off eBay to get a tomato timer for the purpose of this video and yeah, that's a pepper. So I'm not saying get one of those and use that. You can just use your phone. Set little timers on your phone like doing your uh, stopwatch or you can get dedicated apps and now uh, there are a few apps which I really like like there's if you just search Pomodoro Technique, there's this one which is really nice and bog standard. It's a little bit like the timer, as you can see. It's just called Focus Keeper. And then there are other ones as well where you get little trees and whatnot. It's, it's really simple. But the more simple you keep your studying technique, the easier it's gonna to be to actually do because like what you're studying is complicated. You don't need your studying technique to be complicated. So this is the Study technique I advocate most. Pomodoro technique, have a go and be strict. Yeah. I think we're done now. Because I've not actually filmed anything for a while, I do a short update. I'm gonna move this stuff around in the room again but that's for a purpose of actually getting a new board. I'm not going to be writing on a whiteboard anymore, hopefully going to move on to a chalkboard if it is good quality. Meant to turn up tomorrow, 